So oh, yeah, power. we got it going on here. Don't let the strobe <laughs> in the background. We're turning it into a disco. That's Actually, that's not a fire alarm, so do not become alarmed. This, this is, is the John Riggins time. Show. Disco oh, yeah, Wednesday. we're right. I feel good about John Wall. <laughs> I, I enjoyed too. watching him play. I if you too. went to the game last night, you feel like you got your money's worth just by watching that kid. Hell, you got your money's worth before the game started when he started dancing. <laughs> Thank you, Todd. Yeah. What are we doing next? Or are we Let's just going to cancel the show? Let's talk about the final <laughs> we didn't play come to analyze. in the Wizards' amazing win last night. We're going to break it down with the telestrator. <laughs> there may be nothing but blood and guts in here by the time this show closes yeah. out. That to the uninitiated, it looked like luck. It looked like it looked like disorganized <laughs> chaos. <laughs> you I want Saunders right fired? <laughs> <laughs> well, if he didn't have a play, oh. whose fault is that? No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that. <laughs> well, was shut the hell up! I think Lou's got a man crush on number five. You oh, did too at one point. Does. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Lou definitely uh -oh. does. Lou's got a you can't take away the integrity again. Well, he already did for you, sucker. <laughs> <laughs> we are now joined by Rigo's recon caps expert, Julie DeBella. Hey, Julie? where are the white women at? <laughs> She's right here. She's right here. All the Jayhawks, the jersey swarm, the ball carrier. I see that. I start trotting toward the sidelines. <laughs> <laughs> then I hear the crowd going crazy and roaring. And I turn around and look and hear the punt return <laughs> going down the sideline. And I just kept trotting because I said, hey, God. <laughs> well, if you haven't figured out by now, I'm Albert De Silva, better known as the Boston Strike. <laughs> <laughs> rounds start coming in your direction it just it keeps that adrenaline level level high i think by the end of it when we finally got a two-hour break we've been going for 36 almost 38 hours non-stop non a thousand yards is pretty much 10 football fields laid right. out good friend of mine dan hampton of the chicago well formerly of the chicago bears all pro defensive lineman dan welcome to the show and thank you so much for giving us some time this afternoon how in the world are you my dear friend <laughs> i, I my you're dead on, Rigo. And, you know, like I said when I came on, my neck has never been the same. I'm not mad at you. It's just part of the game. <laughs> oh, I agree. You chickify this game much more, and then we're going to go the way of the NASCAR. Chickify. I mean, th those guys would would have a come-to-Jesus moment with, you know, guys like you oh, three yeah. or four times a game. And guess what? It wasn't just that Sunday, but every Peckerwood that was watching that film the rest of the year. So I it made it. my job easier. He's, he's, just got not, he's soaking wet. He's just got a pair of jeans on, no shirt. i got to assume he doesn't have any shoes. Trying to crawl into a woman's car because he's cold. Actually, for the Colts, that's a good thing. That helps enhance their image. They're boring. We're out in Indianapolis for crying out loud. At least you let people know, hey, we're alive. We got some players out here. We got some guys that like to boogie, you know? It's like, I think of the Colts, I think of oatmeal or something. They got nothing. I remember when I used the word uh, punk years ago. Richard Shoemaker, who used to be a guard down at Leavenworth, out in Centray, and he says, you better be careful when you're using that word punk. You sure you know what that word punk means? I said, yeah, he's a punk. You know, he's a punk. And he says, well, I think you better check out what that word means. <laughs> See, I think in prison it has different meaning. <laughs> I was only about 40. Rigan Show on Masson and WTOP 103.5 HD3 and worldwide at Rigo44.com. Finally, me and Lou's going to just lay out here for a little bit. Right? Break it down. Break We're it down. down. We got James going. He needs to pick things up.